guys me and Jeff are out today it's a Wednesday and we got a black cat cool house here built 1850s An old farmhouse for this area there we'll hunt so we're gonna get after it here chance of rain it's been spotty rain here off and on so it's been awful hot today's a little cooler it's only about 85 or so, so yard's been hunted before. So we'll see what we can get. On to the next one. Hey guys, check this one out. You just never know what you're gonna find. Just pop this dude out. It's a foreign coin of some sort. Looks like it's got a muskrat on it. Or a Looks like a rat of some kind. And it's a foreign coin. I don't know if you can see a date on her. I haven't been able to find a date on her yet. Some kind of foreign relic. That's cool. You just never know how stuff's going to get in these yards and stuff. A pretty neat find, though. take it. Like I say, I don't know what it is. Some kind of foreign deal. Got some lady on the front, some rat on the back. Alright, let's see if we can get something else. I'll see if I can find a date later. Maybe you can see it. I can't. Alright, I'm going to show Jeffy what this is. I have no idea. Looks like a one center though. Alright, let's see if we can get something else. Hey guys, just got me a no cash value token. All right, boy, it's pretty on that one side, isn't it? Got the eagle and all. Find these quite often. Just junk though. It's still cool. All right, let's see if we can get something else. All right, guys, on a 1242, 1243 signal, down about six inches or so. Just pop my tootsie car for a while. I hadn't found one in a while. It's a purple job. All right. Happy to have that. I got several of these, but I'm kind of fixing them up and going along. So every one I can get, I appreciate it. That's definitely a tootsie. All right, that's a good find. Let's go on to the next one. All right, guys, I'm on 1242 signal. I just pulled this big honking brass-looking bracelet out. It was down about five inches. That's pretty cool. All right, let's see if we can get something else. Hey, guys, the storms are coming. But we just dug this, or I just dug this pendant here. It says Ozark Empire Fair, 1994. Livestock exhibitor. That's a cool find. All right, let's get something else. Move location on this old site now. So let's see what we can get here. The rains are coming though, so I hear it thunder and lightning. Maybe it'll make the coins bounce out of the ground a little better. We will see. All right, stay tuned. Hey guys, down about four inches of here. I just popped this out of the ground on a 1241 signal. Looks like it's a little bitty eagle. You can see the wings on it. Got little bitty wings on it. I'm not sure what it's off of, but it's pretty cool. Little bitty buckle or a little pendant or something. It's pretty neat. My first find here. Uh, of any consequence, and we will go on. All right, stay tuned. Guys, we're in a new spot now. Just getting started. And I just popped this out of the ground. It says Easton, New York, I believe. I almost think it's a pencil sharpener, but I'm not for sure. But I'll clean it up later. And we will go on. See what else we can get. I'm pretty excited about this thing. Don't know what it is, though. We'll find out later. Hey, guys, on a 1229 signal. 
just popped this dude out and it was a Missouri sales tax token it's in pretty good shape too and not found one of them in a while all right I'll take that one and let's see if we can get something else there we go I believe it's a Frisco but that's cool Frisco was a railroad it was in the area. There we go. Now we got it right. Shank's still intact. That's a cool button now. That's awesome. That's my best find of the day. I'm happy to have that. All right, let's see if we can get some more. And ship it on Frisco. Been out of business since the 70s. Cool button though. Awesome. Let's get some more. Hey gang, Missouri Mike back again. Let's see what we got on this hunt. Short hunt. Didn't spend a whole lot of time out. Didn't get out till in the afternoon, but wasn't that great either. Only got four clad pennies. Two dimes, a nickel and a quarter clad. And about five zinc pennies I did get a <clears throat> play token no cash value on this dude they must have made a lot of those you got a Missouri tax token again they must have made a lot of those too one mil got a 1920 wheat head right there and a 1970 one cent Australian penny, I believe it is, from Australia. It's got a rat on the back. That's cool. You never know what you're going to find. Shotgun head stamp, the exhibitioner deal from the Ozark Fair in 1994. Not that old. This was my, I believe that's to be a uh, sharpener, pencil sharpener. It's got some writing on it here. It says something about New York on it. And my best find of the day was my very last dig was this Frisco Railroad button. That's a good find. Them, those are neat. It's got a nice shank on the back. Happy to have that. Frisco Railroad was a railroad here in town until about 72 or so. Got bought up at Burlington Northern and got gobbled up and destroyed. So anything with their stuff on it, pretty cool. I did get this big old stainless, or stain, not brass, big old brass bracelet too. It's brass. I dug that. That was pretty sweet. All right. And, oh, I did get a Tootsie car. Let me show you it. I restored it. Walk in here. This is my display cabinet that I'm working on, but I kind of restored this one. It wasn't in that bad a shape, but it turned out really, really well. So, that was all my finds. I think that one was the purple one when I found it. I reclaimed it and tried to bring it back. Now it's red. That turned out nice. Okay, guys, there's my Tootsie collection so far that I've restored. And there's my old coupe car that I found. Mm. Yeah, it's fun to, fun to do. Okay, well, appreciate you coming along, and as always, on to the next one. This is Mike, and I'm out.